Hi there, Cancer and Kreeft. This is your reading from the 1st to the 7th of July 2018. I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot on YouTube and Mimi and Buddy Advice on Facebook. And I'll have to explain in Dutch uh, just a little bit, guys, and then I will be doing the video completely in English. Lieve Kreeft, I uh, appreciate that you me volgt, uh, maar ik uh, heb werk buiten het huis, zo so ik kan helaas niet elke week de video's uh, in Nederlands doen, maar de maandelijkse uh, blijven Nederlands en Engels. So, uh, als je geen Engels kan, zet dan even de ondertiteling aan. Er is ook een video om uit te leggen hoe je dat moet doen. Oké, okay, we gaan verder in Engels. Hi Cancer, this is your reading from the 1st to the 7th of July and I hope you will enjoy it. Please become a member if you're new, welcome to the channel and if you are new please subscribe and hit the bell then you'll be notified when I go live or when new videos are uploaded. I come in every day to give you the card of the day and um, so if you want to be notified click the bell if you don't, don't click the bell, but please do subscribe and it will be saved in your library. Then you can find the channel much easier. Okay, let's get started. The, <clears throat> the layout is Monday, Wednesday, Friday and the weekend. The cards underneath are the clarification cards. Two cards above, then I've got um, the answer of the angels and the romance of the angels and the queen of the moon oracle deck. That's my one of my newest. Okay, you've got um, the seven of swords uh, on Monday, the first. Somebody has left in a haste and left something behind and taken something with him, most probably that doesn't belong to him. But in other words, he could have left in a haste and left you with behind with a broken heart or the, uh, them. It could be he or she, it doesn't really matter. Um, so you might be feeling a little bit low on Monday. You are seeking advice on Wednesday from a, a, a professional person or a father figure as you have the emperor. Um, on Friday, you ha are, have the Nine of Pentacles. That means that you're closing off a phase and going into a much better and a luxurious phase. At the weekend, you are receiving news about money, about work, about a job, perhaps a pregnancy uh, or an expectancy or a birth, because the coins uh, stand for durability and long term. They uh, also stand for fertility, birth, growth, blossoming and harvesting. So if you've invested then you might get news that you are going to receive rediment. Um, you might re receive news that you, uh, your contract for work um, is going to be offered to you and whether you can come in and sign it. I, that's just all hypothetical. You know what resonates with you. On Monday you have the official, you have news coming in because you've got the letter. It could be official because of the seal on the envelope and um, that might be that somebody owes you money perhaps when they left and you'll be getting that and it could be official. It could also be that you've passed your diploma since it is July and it's the end of the school year and you might get official news that you have passed and you're getting your diploma and or you're being let in by a university or a college. On Wednesday you've got the star and the advice that you seek is good advice because you want you've got a wish and that wish will be fulfilled at the end of the week by the looks of it and you've got advice on how to go about it 
on Friday you have the man and the man stands for you might meet a man or you have to be more masculine stand your ground be more business-like um, and um, be patient so you might have to be more business-like and more savvy in order to, to um, finish off the uh, old period or phase and go into the new phase and create luxury and money. Perhaps you went to see a broker or an accountant and uh, because you, your wishes come true and um, you have to be business-like so because it's lying quite close to the um, emperor as well. Uh, he's very businesslike because he's got the world in his hands and he knows how to rule his kingdom and the world. So you are investing most probably and your boats are coming in and you're going to hear about it. Helpful, um, uh, the answer of the angels are helpful people. Here you are, you've got an advisor and you've had your investment so you've got helpful people around you the emperor and the man the emperor could be a woman but it is most likely to be a man for the love uh, card we have it is safe for you to love open your heart to give and to receive the highest energy of all so in order to get something you have to open up your heart and open up your mind to receive and trust yourself and trust others this is a beautiful card it's 32 so that's a five so you're not quite in balance yet and you're taking the word trust um, on board and you're going to think about it and you can meditate on that and you can see somebody lying there in an egg and that could be a spiritual birth or a real birth like I said you might be receiving news of a birth okay cancer I hope you've enjoyed this little reading for the week of the 1st to the 7th um, 2019 I got it wrong in the beginning my excuses um, and I hope you enjoy your week and I hope to see you in the tea room that's the live chat and I'm hoping to meet you take care good good luck and Please share and like with family and friends.